Hey guys and welcome to the third game we are starting today and it is Democracy 3. Oh yeah. I picked it up on Steam yesterday. I never played it. Never ever ever played it. For real. <laughs> so this is completely new to me. Completely. So we can... and this is a game about uh, ruling a country. So in the Don't Start we are ruling a base and trying to um, survive like a Robinson Crusoe or something like that. Um, in Crusader Kings we are trying to be an emperor and become the ruler as a count. And in Democracy we are already a ruler and we are already a prime minister or a president or something like that depending on which country, and we are trying to keep the power and rule the actual country. Now, we have to choose which country we are going to rule. Uh, cannabis, <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, population growth, internet users, all that stuff. Population, life expectancy. Roman Catholic, Christian, Christian, a bit more popular, <laughs> beer consumption, sausage consumption, <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, you have the US, Canada, and Australia. What will it be? I wonder. Uh, I think we're gonna go Germany, actually, since we are uh, in the Kaiser trip or maybe there, something something else since we are into the holy roman empire in crusader kings let's try something else uh like australia big mac index four dollars oh yeah let's sure let's just go australia why not uh party's name um reform People's Movement, Justice Party, <laughs> oh, the Jehovah Party, oh awesome, uh, I think I'm gonna go green actually, let's go green, Opposition Party name, yeah, yeah we're gonna go against your old Jehovah for sure, term length, term limit, um, let's uh, Let's limit ourselves to four terms, okay? I don't know. Uh, earthquakes, hurricanes, monarchy, monarchy, really? Compulsory voting, difficulty? Um, I feel like I need just to get a, a little bit of, um, of an easier difficulty for starters, because as I said, just nothing uh no experience at all we are gonna see if we can posturing on foreign press if we can rule a country for real for real this being politics and stuff and you know like i don't know <laughs> enact laws click to return to government all right Welcome to Democracy 3. You have just started your first term as Prime Minister. And as your Chief of Staff, I'm here to explain how things work. The icons below show you a few key indicators of the state of your country. Hopefully you can share things for the better and get re-elected after your term is up. Press the button in the window below marked Begin Term of Office to start governing. Okay. So the GDP is way down. Unemployment is way up. <laughs> Education is very good, that's the thing. Poverty is halfway, kind of. Health, not too bad, and crime is pretty high. Okay, so we have a lot to do. From here, you can survey your, the current state of your country. It may look complex, but all the different components work in very similar ways. The icons represent different objects in the economy or society, including policies, lo laws, voter groups, and values for important concepts such as health, education levels, and of our citizens. Click the next one. These strips in the center of the screen represent group of voters with the, col with the colored progress bars indicating how happy they are with, the with your government. The light gray area behind the text show... Okay, that, that thing. 
um, shows the percentage of our electorate that is in each of these groups. One of the key concepts of Democracy 3 is to understand, understand that individual voters can be members of many different voter groups at once, and the extent to which they identify with all those, gr those groups is in itself variable. You will never get all of these voter groups to entirely approve of you. White icons are policies to st you start the game with some already implemented, but most can be cancelled and many more can be added. They can also be adjusted po policies of the primary method you use to govern your country. Blue icons represent statistical data rele relevant to your country. They concern abstract concepts such as GD GDP, gross domestic product, crime, or the education level of your citizens. You can affect statistical data only indirectly through policy decisions. Like the other icons, you will find them in different zones of the screen depending on which part of the economy society they represent, transport tax, etc. N icons with a red or green background are situations. They are ongoing events taking place in your country, which may be going well, green, or badly, red. You can encourage good situation and prevent or fix bad ones by your Policy choices. Policies, data, and situation are interconnected through effects. Hovering your mouse over any one of the icons will show how influence flows between them, with green being a positive effect and red, and red being negative. The speed of flow also shows the strength of the effects. Experiment with this and hit next. Let's take a look at a specific group of voters and find out about a uh, and find out more about them. Click on the voter street for million income voters. Okay. The window shows detailed information of a specific group of voters. Uh, each group of voters have their own opinions and priorities, and every event or policy would affect each group in different ways. The chart shows the opinion of these voters over time, as well as how they feel about specific policies and events. This area shows a list of different inputs to this voter group and how they make the group feel. Green effects are good and positive, red effects are bad and negative. These, those effects are, may change over time as policy situations or values change. The sum of all these effects go towards them in how the group feels. Okay, so if I understand correctly, the middle class uh, is uh, influenced by income tax, property tax, and homelessness. And at the current state, they are all negatively influenced by these policies that we have now. You can click on individual effect as a shortcut to see more information about that item. For example, click on the effect showing uh, class voters, income tax. There you go. Jesus. Uh, and where? And here we are at the details screen for income tax. And you can do this for almost any effect between two items. Income tax is a policy, white icons, and this screen shows you uh, you the effects that policy is having. The slider, oh there, okay, is used to control this specific policy. You can use it to adjust income tax up and down, which will change the effect he has on the all the leaking items, such as voter groups, situation, and statistical data. Experiment with the slider and hit next. Okay, so if we go all the way up to raise the income tax, everybody is gonna be super super fucking pissed off but we're gonna get more socialism and equality <laughs> and on the other way it's the same thing all that stuff okay uh so income history and all that stuff um next you probably noticed that the effects show two different values as you move the slider the current darker effect and the effect which the slider is now okay. Eh? Let's leave things that they are for now. Hit the reverse changes button. Right, that's not that's enough looking at income tax. Hit the close button at the top right and let's return to the main screen. Time to check out one of the situations that currently affect affects your our country. Click on any of these situa situation icons you want to more information about. Um what about pollution, since we are the Green Party? This shows information on the selected situation as you can see. Situations have both inputs on the left and outputs. 
and the inputs shows the causes of the situation and the outputs show the effects it has on other objects you can change anything here all you you cannot change anything here. All you can do is see the various effects. Cause, causes the environment, effects, influence over groups. The chart of the top of the screen shows information on the actual strength of the situation over time and two triggers. The trigger, this higher trigger is the value that actually triggers the situation to take effect. The lower trigger de deactivates the situation. As a result, it's easier to trigger a situation, a situation than to end it. Yep. Okay. Value. Okay. So, if I understand correctly, you have to change the value of a thing, um, situation, in order to either either start it or decrease it to stop it. Let's logical let's quit the situation and go look some other data right now hit the close button all right let's take a look at the last type of icons the statistical data click on any of the blue icons statistics okay they are bad thing that we want low such as crime be aware that some statistics are good things but high like health okay there's nothing we can change here so let's hit thing again okay pay attention to this value up here it's that this is political capital, which represents the amount of support the government has to get things done. You have a limited amount of polit political capital per turn. Each turn is a quarter of a year. When you run out, you need to end the turn to get more. Some political capital can be carried over to the next turn, but not all. Political capital is used when you adjust policies, cancel them, or introduce new ones. Different policies require different amounts depending on how controversial they are. Okay, it's time to see how you create a new policy. Create a new policy. Oh, there are new policies put forward by your ministers. This, the policies are divided into categories since as tabs as the top. Details of, a selecto, details of a selected policy are on the right. Those in red cannot currently be implemented due to the lack of political capital. Select the policy and then hit the, the implement button. Okay. Because local company cannot match the lower salaries paid by foreign competitors. Pro tariffs import conflict. Local manufacturers from unfair competition. This goes against real free market economics though and can be seen as being unfair to foreign countries, posting sparkling retaliation. Ooh. How about tax? Mm. Welfare. Law and order. <laughs> Race Discrimination Act. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna put the... I'm gonna protect my policy, my uh, industries. Yeah, this is new policies. You can adjust the slider. Of new policies free without using it up political capital. Be aware that some policies take time to implement, which means it will be a while before they are fully operational. For now, let's go back to the main screen. Hit the close button at the top right. So we're not implementing that. Okay. Once you finish what you can do or want to do in a quarter, it's time to end. It's the next turn button at the top right. Okay, so we are probably making it like a free turn for a tutorial or something. I don't know. Click to return to the Oh, this is a quarterly report. It will highlight some key indicators which impact upon the current state of the country. Plus, there may be other information you need to be aware of. Urgent dilemmas may appear that need your attention this quarter. Anyway, I can see you have a lot to attend to, so I'll get you. I'll let you get to work. I'm sure the government is in safe hands now. Yeah, cool. Thank you. Um, security briefing. Party has declared the government to be illegitimate, and it's urged its supporters to oppose it in every way. Okay, so we have a revolution upon the hand. 
That's awesome. Death protection law. There's an urgent policy question that requires an immediate. Okay. Then. Recession. Okay. So we have a lot of problems right now. Not cool. All right. So, what is dire? I think the GDP is one of them. Am I right? Right now we are. Oh no, we are positive in income, actually. Cool. Okay. And what is affecting. Where is the um, that that situation? Oh, there you go. Socialists. Okay. Religious. All that stuff. Self-employed. All right. Um. I'm gonna work on uh, pollution. I think. Yes. And the causes are the environment. What's wrong with... Okay. And it's causing health. Okay, it's influencing on upon health. Alright. On lifespan. And... Environment. Mm-hmm. CO2 emissions carbon tax okay let's um let's enact the carbon tax maybe okay and raise it a little bit Like that, boom. First, our first, <laughs> uh, our first uh, decision has been made. <laughs> what else? Vigilante mobs, crime. Hmm. We need to um, to 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 organize crime and all that stuff. Okay, uh, how can we influence crime? <laughs> Prisons, police force, tasers, wiretapping. Armed police? Shit. Intel what about education? Yeah. Um if we invest invest in um more in more education, I guess it would resolve a little bit of crime. <laughs> Science funding. Sure, let's. Um... <laughs> no way. Um, let's uh, fund a little bit more the science. I don't know how much to uh, to improve those those things. When I, you know, it's um, it's tough thing to do actually. Uh, to know, I guess. What's that? Antisocial behavior. Okay. Interesting. 
Hmm. What about recycling? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's all. Recycling. Universal doorstep thing. What? Uh huh. <laughs> okay, so uh, limited doorstep thing. That'll be good. More recycling. Awesome. Okay, we need to uh, get a little bit more. Um, On the side of uh, ethnic, well, actually, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Can influence productivity by solving asthma. <laughs> All right, car usage. Oh yeah, I want to uh, actually. I do want to um, to enact a new policy. National service, new transport. Mm. Yes, let's implement the telecommuting initiative. Awesome. Medium. Uh, hi. Yeah. Cool. Parents are gonna love us for it. Uh, we have more, 16 more. Um, okay. So, I'm sorry I'm kind of slow, but I'm, it's really is the uh really is the first time <laughs> that i ever played that game so yeah jury trial universal yeah sure anyone can judge <laughs> sure 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 uh Petrol tax. We're gonna tax her a bit more. Oh, raise thirty six. Oh, okay, that's um, that's too much. Okay, well, um, I guess uh, I would end the turn then. Where is? Debt protection law. Debt collection agencies have been in the news because of the aggressive methods they are using to extract payment from people who owe large sums of money. These debt collection agencies provide credit to people whom larger, more respectable companies will not lend money. A law is proposed to limit the ways in which such agencies can operate. Mm, yeah, let's. Um, Let's limit the violence there, please. Okay, uh, what else? Cabinet ministers. So as we have working, okay, so that is my ministers. Okay, thank you. Show potential ministers. Mm, like 2.4, it's not great. <laughs> uh, for law and order. We have someone who is desiring law and order is better. Yes, this guy. Can we not? Can we? No. Mm -hmm. Fire. 
<laughs> Fire. Higher. I want the, this guy. Actually, this one. Way better. Way better. Higher. There you go. And we have only five. Maybe we can uh, fire another one. Like this one. Boom. <laughs> and we can um, uh, transport. Okay, loyalty, experience, no experience. Uh, this guy. I was supposed to hire for law and order, but transport is good too. Okay, that's better. Gonna have more fists of power. Click to return to government. Here's a summary. Okay, so GDP always. Uh, oh, crime is rising. Really? Uh, then the policy question that requires people smuggling. A large number of people have been caught entering our country hidden inside cargo containers. Deport them. Fuck that. Fuck that shit. I'm deporting that shit. <laughs> this is Australia. I mean, each quarter, which is a great news. Good. Okay. Can. Lawyer. It's passable. Not quite uh, efficient, but they are loyal to us. Farmers, what's going on? Farmers, nothing. Nothing is influencing on farmers at the moment. Uh, economics, tax, public service, law and order, transport, foreign policy, welfare. I don't know. Labor laws. Okay. Pollution controls. Oh. Ho ho ho. Um. Mm -hmm. Pollution controls. Mm hmm. We're gonna implement that. Good, 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 good. And now we're gonna try to get a little bit of liberals upon us. I mean, get some popularity with them. Uh, okay, abortion law. So we want more influence with um to ban two doctors on demand yeah conservatives are going to be a little bit pissed off but oh we don't have enough Jesus, we have 20 okay hmm uh liberals what else jury trial universal now you already made that mm. child's benefit can we raise nine yay hi yay cool and maybe a new new one She was oh no in continuation they are able to afford food rent controls system private rental okay um <laughs> hybrid cars initiative yay let's do that cool um, I think we are done for this quarter and we're gonna put an end an, on this superhero <laughs> it's the news station of Bosling can be kept man okay nice 
Okay. We have less crime, but I think um, we should maybe uh, help a little bit. Oh, crime is now. No, it's still red. Sorry. No. Uh, what's that? Homelessness. Yeah. <laughs> Mm -hmm. uh, how can we mm -hmm. science funding let's do that more Homelessness, right? If we want, we want red. Prisons. Really? Prisons? Police force. Okay. Gambling? Okay. Um, okay, let's improve our police, actually. Because... Because we need it. <laughs> Okay, we are gaining influence over patriot env environment conservatives and losing towards ethnic, of course, because we're deporting people. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, let's uh, use our all our things. Uh, carbon tax. That's cool. Um. <laughs> Alcohol tax, um, property, corporation, new um, income. Mm -hmm. okay, this is uh, on the way, I guess. Can we increase a little bit our legalized prostitution? <laughs> oh Jesus! Um, gambling. Foreign investor tax break. Okay, we're gonna piss off a little bit the patriots, but I don't care. We're gonna apply that. There you go. And. Oops. And. Nope. Try. Economy. Chunk mm. <laughs> food tax. It's gonna be a really healthy um, country. Plastic bag, sure. Let's get high on this one. And this is it, I think. Next turn, and we're gonna finish that here on the screen. We are raising our GDP. Unemployment is still not going down. We are not no longer as now subsided. We are no longer uncompetitive. Awesome. Freedom of information. There have been calls for law to increase the availability of information on databases. Um, proposed Freedom Act. It should not be spied or monitored. Sure. Let's all be free. Anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching uh, our first, very, very first Let's Try of Democracy 3. I don't know if I'm doing well or not. I'm improving stuff, apparently. Uh, and uh, I see you next time for episode 2 of Democracy 3 in as 
the ruler of Australia. Thank you. Bye-bye.